my name is Ryan, and I am currently a resident in Boulder County in Longmont, Colorado. What I'm doing professionally right now is that I'm the marketing manager for Longmont Public Media. In my free time, uh, I, I like to play Pokemon Go with friends. I like to, um, I like to listen to audiobooks. I like to listen to podcasts. I like to draw, yes. In fact, I am actually working on a graphic novel right now. Uh, a graphic novel that I wrote, draw, and uh, I'm penciling and in, in, uh, inking the pages and I will eventually be coloring as well. Um, it's an ambitious project and um, I'm excited about it. The theme of my graphic novel is, um, is restorative justice and how restorative justice can help in real life. What I see as the biggest problem with the criminal justice system as it stands today is the fact that we want to find someone to blame and then we want to just put them away and not think about them again. Instead of actually looking at what caused the issue in the first place and how do we resolve that issue that led to that person doing whatever they did. If I could travel into the future or into the past, uh, I would go back into the past and uh, listen to one of the greatest performances ever performed back in uh, ancient Rome that could not be recorded. It was, it packed up the house. Everyone said it was the greatest performance of all time and they, there's no recording of it. You'll never know what happened. And I'd love to hear what that sounded like. If I could go anywhere in the world for two, all expenses paid for two days, I would probably go to New Zealand because it seems incredible. The scenery seems incredible and um, I've seen it in movies, but I've never seen it in real life. If I could have any automobile in the world, uh, it would be one of those uh, tricycle cars because, you know, I just like standing out. If I could have anything in the world for dinner, no expense, it would be nachos from Garfinkel's. If I had to be stuck in an elevator with somebody, ooh, um, I, yeah, who do I want to be stuck in an elevator with? Um, honestly, if I had to be stuck in an elevator with somebody, I would be, I'd want to be stuck with, uh, <laughs> with the woman I'm dating right now, who's Francis. <laughs> if I had a choice between going to the moon or going to the deepest depths of the sea floor, I would honestly choose going to the moon, mainly because for some reason going to the deepest depths of the sea floor seems scarier to me. If I had a chance to give everyone in the world a worldwide message, it would be anytime you're thinking about blaming anyone, instead think about who was hurt, what's the problem, and how can we solve it? My favorite book is probably going to be uh, Hard Times by Charles Dickens. My favorite performer is Chromeo because they know how to put on a show. My favorite animal, probably dogs, because get along with them. And it's, yeah, uh, when I was born, my parents always told me that I was part dog because I was raised around them. And I, no matter what the situation, I'm never afraid of dogs because they feel like family to me. If I could be any dog for a day, I would be a Great Dane because they have the best personality. They're huge. Uh, which means they can run really fast, though they get really tired and they can just nap everywhere. Plus they can sit on people. My favorite color is orange. I thought at first, because uh, my parents both went to UT, so they surrounded my room with like UT stuff that was all burnt orange. But eventually I realized I really like this, you know, this bright orange right here. Um, it stands out and it's different, which is what I like being different. My dream for the future is that there will never be a problem so big that we want to cause harm to someone else.
In conclusion, I would like to say I feel honored to be a human of Longmont and I really just enjoy being part of this community and I want to be part of it for a long time.